Okay, hello gamers. GameStiller back with another video today, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install the Counter Strike source for Gary's mod. Because this is what it looks like at the moment without it. This is what it's supposed to look like. And I'm going to show you guys how to fix that. Okay, hey guys, so what you're going to first want to do is you're going to want to open up Google or whatever you actually use. So I'm just using Google Chrome, search up CS Jita, and it should just be the first website. If not, it's the kajar9.wix.com slash cheetah2. The link will be in the description as per always, guys. Um, you got the home on the right, you got the Gary's mod, just click that. And then... The one that you want to download is Counter-Strike Source, but I do suggest downloading every single one of these because it is just a lot better. And then you make sure you have all the textures. The only one you don't want to download is Counter-Strike Global Offense because that can actually stuff up your Garry's mod and break it because it's only for development purposes. Um, best one that I suggest you guys to go for is just the for shared game content. So click that. You don't need to worry about any of the maps. It doesn't really matter. Then you'll come up with this ad fly thing. Don't worry about it. Just let it load through. I just and made eight hundred and thirty-four dollars in less than ten. And then a new tab will open. Just close the previous one. All right. I'll say thank you for downloading my files. Enjoy. Just click download. And then it'll most likely ask you to sign in once you click this. So you can either use your Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, Instagram. Or you can just sign up with an account. I'm just going to use Facebook for now, guys. Then the countdown will go down. I will just skip this part for you guys. Okay, then it will start downloading. It will say thank you for downloading the CSS underscore content underscore add on underscore December 2015 zip. It will then start to download. I already downloaded this, guys, so I'll just cancel this for now. You're then going to need to go to my computer, um, go to downloads. And then it should just be right here. I've already dragged it to my desktop. Um, you can just leave it there or drag it to your desktop. I drag it to my desktop because it's just a little bit easier for me. You're then going to need to open up this file location. So you're going to need to go to in my computer again. And then local disk C, program 86. Scroll down. Go to Steam. Steam apps. Common. Gary's mod. Gary's mod add-ons and then you're gonna want to put it in here so all you gotta do is open it up I do suggest either WinRAR um, zip or just any of the programs all of them will work it's quick easy download then all you guys gotta do is click drag across Once WinRAR has done that little thing, then all WinRAR will actually open up a Windows Explorer and start moving the items across, guys. Okay, so once that is, all you need to do is open up Gary's mod. Okay, so guys, now I've loaded it up. We've now got the Counter-Strike source installed, and now it is looking beautiful. All textures there, working, and it's not stopping up. So as per you can see, the car was an error, the like machine things were errors, and probably this whole room was a pink black piece of shit. Now it is working. That is how you fix it. Peace out. See you guys next time. Yeah.